So that looks great. Now I'm going to click Done. I'm going to go ahead and save this and turn it into a movie. At the bottom of my screen, I have an icon that has an arrow and a rectangle. I'm going to click that now. This is a way for me to actually turn it into a movie and share it. So I think what I'm going to do is select Save Video. With this option, it lets me choose either medium, large, HD, or HD 1080p. 1080p is the best quality. It's going to look great on a computer or a TV screen or anything like that. I'll select that option. And it'll take just a minute or two to go ahead and export the movie out of iMovie so that we can watch it. When it's finished with this section, we'll be able to watch it inside of our photo gallery. The movie was exported to your photo library. I click OK. I'm now going to exit out of iMovie. And I'll go ahead and swipe over to get to photos. Inside of photos, I'm going to click on videos. And here's a list of all my video clips that I have now. So I'll go ahead and select the one and click play. Hopefully this quick tutorial gets you started with using iMovie in the classroom. It's a great tool and I think it will really help your students express their creativity. I'm looking forward to seeing what all of you teachers do with your students and the projects in your classroom.